Are you ready to witness God's transformative power in your life? Have you ever felt overwhelmed by life's challenges, wondering if there's any hope? My friends, today we explore how God can turn your battles into blessings. If you believe that God can make a difference in your life today, let us stand together in faith. I will pray a fervent prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. Imagine a skilled jeweler examining a rough, unpolished stone. To the untrained eye, it may seem worthless, but the jeweler sees its hidden potential. With expert hands, he cuts, shapes, and polishes until a brilliant diamond emerges. This is how God works in our lives, transforming our struggles into something beautiful. As we read in Romans 8, verse 28, And we know that all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are called according to His purpose. God's promise is clear. He can take our battles and turn them into blessings. Today, we'll explore three powerful perspectives on how God works in our lives. Number one, refining through fire. My dear friends, sometimes we often wonder why God allows difficulties in our lives. The answer lies in His desire to refine and strengthen your faith. Just as gold is purified by fire, our faith is tested and strengthened through trials. In 1 Peter 1, verses 6 to 7, we find these words of encouragement. In this, you greatly rejoice, though now for a little while, if need be, you have been grieved by various trials, that the genuineness of your faith being much more precious than gold that perishes, though it is tested by fire, may be found to praise, honor, and glory at the revelation of Jesus Christ. God uses our battles to burn away impurities in our character and faith. He's not punishing us, but preparing us for greater things. Consider the story of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in the fiery furnace. Their faith was tested in the hottest of fires, yet they emerged unharmed and stronger. Their unwavering trust in God turned a potential tragedy into a powerful testimony. My friends, your current struggles are not meant to destroy you. They are opportunities for God to showcase His power and refine your faith. When you face trials, Remember that God is with you in the fire. He's not a distant observer, but an active participant in your journey. Your battles are temporary, but the blessings that come from them are eternal. As you endure, your faith grows stronger. Your character develops and your testimony becomes more powerful. Think about the areas in your life where you're facing challenges right now. How might God be using these situations to refine you? What impurities is He burning away? Trust that He's working all things for your good, even when you can't see it. Your current battle could be the very thing God uses to prepare you for your biggest blessing. So, my friends, don't lose heart in the midst of your trials. Embrace them as opportunities for growth and transformation. Allow God to refine you through the fire, knowing that on the other side, you'll emerge stronger, purer, and more radiant than ever before. Number two, redirecting our path. My friends, have you ever taken a wrong turn while driving, only to discover a beautiful scenic route? Sometimes, what we perceive as setbacks are God's way of redirecting us to a better path. In Proverbs 16, verse 9, we read, A man's heart plans his way, but the Lord directs his steps. 
God often uses our battles to guide us towards His perfect plan for our lives. What seems like a roadblock might actually be a divine detour. Consider the story of Paul on his missionary journeys. He faced numerous obstacles, imprisonment, shipwrecks, and persecution. Yet, these challenges led him to preach in places he never planned to visit. His battles became opportunities to spread the gospel far and wide. My dear friends, your current struggles may be God's way of redirecting you. Perhaps you've lost a job, faced a health crisis, or experienced a relationship breakdown. These battles, painful as they are, could be steering you towards your true purpose. God sees the bigger picture that we often miss. He knows what lies ahead and uses our present circumstances to position us for future blessings. When we trust His guidance, even our detours become destiny. Think about a time when a seeming setback led to an unexpected blessing in your life. That's God at work, turning your battles into blessings. He's not just solving your problems. He's shifting your perspective. Through your challenges, God is teaching you to rely on His wisdom rather than your own understanding. He's showing you that His plans are higher than yours, and His ways are, are better. As you navigate through life's twists and turns, remember that God is your GPS. He never loses sight of your final destination, even when the route seems unfamiliar. Your current battle might be redirecting you to a blessing you never imagined possible. So, my friends, when life takes an unexpected turn, don't resist. Instead, trust that God is redirecting you towards something greater. Your battle today could be the very thing that leads you to your biggest breakthrough tomorrow. Embrace the journey, knowing that God is guiding every step. And number three, revealing His glory. My friends, have you ever wondered why some of the greatest testimonies come from the toughest trials? It's because God often uses our battles as a canvas to display His glory. In John 9, verse 3, Jesus explains why a man was born blind. Jesus answered, Neither this man nor his parents sinned, but that the works of God should be revealed in him. God allows certain battles in our lives not to harm us, but to set the stage for a divine showcase. When we overcome through His power, it becomes a powerful testimony to the world. Think about the account of Lazarus being raised from the dead. His sickness and death seemed like a tragedy, but Jesus used it to demonstrate God's power over death. What appeared to be a battle became a platform for a miracle that still inspires faith today. My dear friends, your current struggles are not just about you. They are opportunities for God to reveal His glory to those around you. When you stand firm in faith during trials, people take notice. They see the peace that surpasses understanding, the strength that defies circumstances. Your battle becomes a beacon of hope for others facing similar challenges. God's glory shines brightest against the backdrop of our darkest moments. When you overcome addiction through His power, it's a testimony. When your marriage is restored against all odds, it's a miracle. When you maintain joy in the face of loss, it's a witness. Each battle you face with God by your side becomes a story of His faithfulness. Remember, you're not fighting alone. God is working behind the scenes, orchestrating a victory that will bring Him glory. Your perseverance through trials becomes a living sermon, more powerful than any words could express. So, my friends, don't be discouraged by your battles. Instead, See them as opportunities for God to reveal His glory through you. Your struggle today could be someone else's source of hope tomorrow. Trust that as you allow God to work in and through your challenges, 
He will turn your battles into blessings, not just for you, but for many others. Your life is a testimony in the making, a powerful display of God's glory unfolding day by day. Embrace your battles with this perspective, knowing that God is using them to reveal His glory in ways you may not yet comprehend. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, you are the Almighty God, the Creator of all things. Your wisdom surpasses human understanding, and your love knows no bounds. I stand in awe of your majesty, your power, and your unfailing grace. You are the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. Your faithfulness endures through all generations. I praise you for your infinite mercy and your perfect justice. Thank you, Lord, for your constant presence in my life. I'm grateful for your guidance through every trial and triumph. Thank you for turning my battles into blessings and for refining me through fire. I confess my sins before you, Lord, and ask for your forgiveness. Cleanse me from all unrighteousness and create in me a pure heart. I also choose to forgive those who have wronged me, just as you have forgiven me. Lord, I bring before you every battle I'm facing right now. Transform these struggles into testimonies of your glory. Use the fires of adversity to purify my faith and strengthen my character. When I feel lost or confused, redirect my steps according to your perfect will. Help me to trust your guidance, even when the path seems unclear. In the name of Jesus, I declare that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. I rebuke every spirit of fear, doubt, and discouragement in the mighty name of Jesus. I bind the enemy's attempts to distort my perspective on my trials. Lord, I surrender my battles to you, knowing that you will fight for me. Give me the strength to persevere, the wisdom to learn, and the faith to trust your plan. Help me see my challenges through your eyes as opportunities for growth and blessing. Use my life as a canvas to display your glory to the world around me. I pray for healing in every area of my life, body, mind, and spirit. Restore what the enemy has stolen and renew my strength and my youth like the eagles. Protect me from the attacks of the enemy, whether physical, emotional, or spiritual. Shield me from sickness, financial lack, relationship conflicts, and mental distress. Surround me with your hedge of protection and let no evil come near my dwelling. Lord, I pray for these same blessings upon my loved ones. Refine them through their trials. Redirect their paths and reveal your glory through their lives. Heal their bodies. Restore their minds and rejuvenate their spirits. Protect them from every scheme of the enemy and shower them with your favor. Lord, as I say this prayer, together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is opening before you right now. We come in agreement, lifting each other up before your throne of grace. Unite us in faith as we face our battles knowing that you're turning them into blessings. Refine us collectively, Lord, that we might shine brighter for your glory. Lord, redirect our paths as a community of believers, leading us into your perfect will. We declare victory over every challenge we face in the mighty name of Jesus. 
We claim the healing you've provided through your stripes for our bodies and our souls. Fill us afresh with your Holy Spirit, empowering us to overcome every obstacle. Thank you for the protection that you provide and the blessings you bestow upon us. We trust that you're working all things together for our good and your glory. For yours is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray, amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, type the word, Amen, in the comment section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you, in the name of Jesus. You can help us to reach more persons and spread the gospel. You can do this by sharing the video with a friend or family member, and by clicking the like button. Also remember, to subscribe to our channel Daily Jesus Prayers for more videos that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We appreciate all your support. You're blessed to be a blessing. Please feel free to leave your prayer request in the comment section so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory and so that other believers on the YouTube platform and all over the world can join us and start praying for you right now. Stand in faith with us while we pray. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.